guys, welcome back to the channel. It's your girl Lissy. Today we're gonna be looking at some of the scariest videos on the entire internet of the creepiest dolls ever created. If you guys are new to the channel, hi, I'm Lissy. I post videos about the strange, the unusual, and the spooky. If you guys like that stuff, be sure to subscribe to join the spooky squad and smash like on today's video if you guys like creepy dolls. And let's get watching these videos. So this girl here has this haunted doll that she got offline and she did an update on it. Let's take a look. Update on my new haunted doll. So if oh you watched my. my previous video, you watched me unbox this new haunted doll. She has a lot of creepy she dolls. differently than pictured. She has Ooh. no clothes and a red X on her Why chest. Why does she have a red X on her chest? Does that indicate something? A lot of you commented that there might be something hidden inside of the doll. Yeah, it kind of seems like the that. Back, there are some hand stitches. Yeah, why is there hand- Okay, there's hand stitches on the back of this doll. There's a red X across the chest. Does an X mark the spot? Like, why was it a red X? Obviously, there's something up with this doll. That look big enough to put something inside. That is weird, unless it broke and someone stitched it. Go open the doll to see if there's anything inside since paranormal activity is happening that's so also, creepy disrespectful this doll really has a bad smell ew like a sickly, stinking sweet, rotting smell a rotting smell that's usually like a demonic spear right okay i want to know what's up with her though so she did post another video where she cut open this doll we're gonna watch that one and see what's inside of the doll i finally opened up this this doll's doll so doll creepy oh my god really weird inside this doll has a horrible, rotten smell. Ew, that thing so looks ancient. I decided to finally open it up and see what's inside what was and in what is causing it. And it's safe to say I definitely found what was causing the smell. It's like a secret note somebody I found left inside this the doll? hidden in the doll's leg. Or is it just like a cloth? I have no idea what to expect, so okay. I just opened with caution. Ooh. But this is definitely the strangest thing I've ever found. This is weird. Wrapped up in a piece of cloth, I found some sort of vial. What the Straight hell is that? I could tell that this was some sort of witchcraft. Witchcraft? Or, or hex or something along those lines. Ew. It's a tube full of this brown liquid. And Ew. A closer look. That's gross. I'm pretty sure that those are teeth. Teeth? Okay, this girl's gonna get cursed by her haunted doll. She just opened a whole tube with a gross liquid and teeth. Like, uh huh. That is the creepiest thing I've seen all day. I hope she got rid of it after that. I got this doll from a local antique auction. Well, that is quite the doll to pick up from an auction, don't you think? I got this doll from a local antique auction. Oh boy. My wife said to get rid of it because she thinks it's haunted and keeps finding random things on the floor. Yeah, I would think it's haunted too if it looked like that. So I decided to leave the house for a bit and film while I was gone. Okay, he's leaving the house with that creepy doll just standing there. They had to speed up the footage? What happened? Nothing so far. Hmm. Oh? That bag is just moving on its own? Not even five minutes later? Oh, now it's moving things around! Okay, that thing's cursed! What? It just flicks something off the fridge? How? This is weird. My dogs were the only ones in the house. <gasps> the dog came to go see what's going on. <gasps> and it got scared? What did he see? Yeah, what did he see? He just like flinched and walked away. I still don't want to get rid of her. What? Why would they not want to get rid of her after that happened? Their poor dog was like, uh-oh, I've seen it all. Clearly they should get rid of the thing. It's about to possess them. Oh, they have another video? You need to remove the batteries at the bottom of the feed as well? Wait, what? That cabbage patch by it has no batteries and it's just walking around? There's no batteries in the thing's feet. What are they talking about? There is- That's the battery slot and it's still working. Maybe that doll that they got was like making the other doll go off. They're working as a duo. The cabbage patch and the cursed doll. Just a theory, but that was really creepy. What is that? And why- why? Okay, I just have a lot of questions. Well, how do these dolls keep getting scarier? This is how I came to own a haunted doll. Oh my god, it just moved its head. I was the shop and I had this feeling I had to go inside. Okay. It seemed like a pretty normal shop with nice things. Then I saw this doll sitting in the corner looking out of the window. I Ooh. asked the owner about the doll and she said her name was Martha. And Martha? I just left her on the doorstep. She That's said cute. I could have her. 
because nobody else wanted her. What? Since coming home, we've had some weird happenings, like lights turning on and off. And it's weird moving sounds. its head. We even caught her moving on camera. Do you see it? That's uh, a little bit weird. Marfa's a whole, I don't know, a whole thing to process, okay? She's special in her own ways. Marfa. <laughs> what kind of name is that? Oh, Lord, how do they... Oh, this is even worse than the last one, okay. This doll was so terrifying. She never even made it inside my house. Yeah, she wouldn't make From it in my house either. The moment I purchased her at the thrift store, I noticed something unusual. Her lips appeared to be painted in blood. Huh? Her very detailed clothing appeared to be hand -stitched. That's creepy. But the most horrific thing about her was how her mouth would just draw you in. Her mouth? And she had one what do you sharp mean? fang that would shapeshift and move. Right before your eyes. What? I'm I watching. I to video it. Okay, how does I it move around? I my light in the best I could. This is really interesting. I was very shaky because yeah, it was dark and I was scared. Okay. And I tried not to show it. That's how we've gotten all but the you'll see. pictures. I'm okay, I'm watching the mouth face. very closely. What is she talking about? about Something shape-shifting in the mouth of the dog. <gasps> no! Oh, the tooth? Wait, it did move! Why is that moving? I don't understand that. It's moving around inside the doll's head. Ew. I don't like that. Do you guys see that? Comment down below if you guys see the yellow thing in the mouth moving around. How is that even possible that it's just moving? Like, I just don't get it. Like, what is that inside the doll's head? Is she just playing some games because she's cursed? Probably. This doll showed up at my house. How did that just show up at their house? Did it just walk up to the door and ring the doorbell and was like, let me in? Because why would they answer? But okay, it showed up at their house for some reason. I thought it was just a sick joke. I was wrong. So it had to be done. Did someone leave a cursed doll at their house as like a revenge mechanism and now she has to break it because it's haunting her life? Oh my god, it's on fire? And then the caption of that girl's TikTok was story time? I bet she has some serious tea about who left the doll at her house and why. I would love to know. Hopefully she posts a story about that. <laughs> Creepy doll commercial from the 1960s. Children have been asking us to make dolls with real growing hair for years Real now. growing hair. The only problem is the current technology doesn't allow for that. So we've oh. turned to the next best thing. A voodoo witch doctor named Captain Voodoo Oogie, who witch can transfer doctor for human kids? souls into plastic dolls to give them lifelike characteristics. What? You can even modify the amount of humanity within the doll using our patented soul knob. I don't Just like this. Just be aware this. that these are technically human children and should not be subjected to normal doll treatment for What do they reasons. mean they're technically human children? Like, what in the voodoo was going on in this commercial? And you're telling me they put that in the TV? And that parents bought that for their kids? Huh? I have a lot of questions and concerns if that was a real thing. If you guys know if that was a real thing, confirm it. I'm pretty sure that is a real thing. Like, I found this on TikTok. But, like, wow, they were really, like, out there with that commercial. Okay, this one says, I always tell my kids not to be scared of this doll until tonight she has to go. What happened? I always tell my kids to not be scared of this doll until tonight. What are she those has orbs? To go. The doll's just <laughs> yes. walking towards her? Oh, hell no! You gotta stop. It is so scary. <laughs> that, okay, that would freak me out if I woke up in the middle of the night and that thing's just la 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 walking down the hallway. Yeet! That's where it's going into the trash can and on fire like that other doll. So, uh, yeah, she told her kids not to be scared, but now she's scared. So, yeah, no, that thing is terrifying. Heather is streaming her haunted doll when this was captured. Okay. Heather is streaming a haunted doll when this was captured. What was captured? Not taking her with me when I move. So if any of you are interested in that doll, please let me know. Because I don't want to keep her, but I'd like her to huh? go to a good home. I mean, if there's somebody out there that's interested, <gasps> I don't. Did that? She just turned her head. <laughs> and now they're swearing and they're all scared. Oh my God! Are you? F you kidding me? Okay, so this girl was talking about her on a doll, and then she's like, Yeah, I don't want her anymore. Does anybody else want her? The doll literally hears that, and it's like, You just said what, ho? <laughs> you just said what? Like, you don't want to keep me? The doll literally was pissed off. Now she is in for it. She is cursed for life for wanting to get rid of the doll. Like, she was like, I ain't about to go to nobody else. She was pissed. Crazy world, okay? What is this? Is that a doll? Huh? Salta, pequeño. Salta, is that pequeño. doll moving by itself? Vamos. Ew, why does it move like it's alive? I don't like this. 
I don't like the face of it. I don't like the, the way it moves. Ew, it's literally walking like a human child. What is this one? Never booking an Airbnb again? That's their Airbnb? Oh, hell no. That was a jump scare. Okay, this girl's playing with her Barbies. And then what's gonna happen? I swear I've seen this video like a million times. It's so viral. The Barbie's head just turns. Just wait, just watch. It's so creepy. Oh my God. I would never play with my Barbies again. Please watch to the end. I'm terrified for my daughter. What is she playing with her toy in the corner of the room for? It moved! It literally moved! The head went yeet! How are these happening? Like, what is going on with these creepy freaking dolls? What makes a doll get haunted? Especially a stuffed puppy. Like, I just don't understand. Don't trust dolls. Okay, let's see. This is why you don't take creepy dolls from anyone. But what if I want to? One afternoon, to? a man went to his basement to cut a piece of wood in his workshop. Okay. In the basement, Jamie's wife, Katie, kept a collection of antique dolls that her aunt had left behind. Huh. And ever since they took those dolls, strange things started happening in the house. As Jamie's leaving the basement, he's stopped by something odd. Mysteriously, the doll chair leans back as if I something's holding it there. How is it just Jamie like defying gravity? Jamie inspects the area in disbelief of what he sees. That's terrifying. Suddenly, the chair swings upright and scares him. How is that even possible? He looked terrified. Like, the chair literally was like this. Like, it was off the ground, two feet were on, like, the back legs, and it was, like, tilted up, so something had to be forcefully holding it up. Huh? And it wasn't, like, attached to a string or anything. There's no way, because, like, it would be shaking a little bit. You know, you can't get it, like, perfect, but, like, that was really creepy, okay? I don't even know if there's, like, any explanation for that to be physically possible. Giant puppets, the scariest doll in the world, okay? That's actually a little creepy. I don't like this at all, okay? The way that there's people up in these dolls, moving around, the eyeballs are moving around. Oh, ew. Okay, I just, the idea of giant puppets never settled right with me. I don't remember which country it is that does this, but it's very normal there. Like they have a bunch of these different giant puppets and they do different things with them. I don't know if they're for like parades or events, but they just don't sit right with me and I just, I don't like them. Anyways guys, those were some of the creepiest dolls ever created in the entire world and some of the most haunted dolls, mostly haunted ones because I love that stuff. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed today's video, be sure to smash the like and subscribe to join the family because I post videos every single week and I don't want you guys to miss out on them. Also guys, be sure to follow my Instagram and my other social medias they're all linked down below and that's gonna do it for today's video thank you all for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one bye guys